Hello everybody, welcome to Monday Night Claw. I'm Jimmy Ventura and joining me in the booth is Elk Meme and Table Leg Wanger. Hello. Come on, let's well, make there. this happen. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Yeah. Um, oh, hey, Wanga. <laughs> thank you very much, HTK, <laughs> with a bits there to uh, to make a hot tub <laughs> a hot tub JFW stream. <laughs> Six books down. <laughs> yep, Theresa Mame looking to potentially book in a hot tub stream <laughs> down the line. Just a matter of uh, securing the correct funding. But we have a stacked event tonight, don't we, on Monday Night Claw? We do, yes, and we're opening up with the Wemdorp Open Challenge. It's Dionysian putting his Wemdorp Championship on the line and anyone in the locker room could come out and take him on. Who knows who it's going to be? It's very exciting. <laughs> it is, it's going to be a... Dio obviously fresh to the JFW himself, but he's put on a couple of performances so far, hasn't he? He's been alright, yeah. Some say he sniped Space Cadet. <laughs> And then, uh, but now he's just blind spinning and uh, whatever he gets, he gets. <laughs> it's an interesting strategy. Let's see if it pays off for him. Yeah. It's not what I would have done, but who's to say whether it's right or wrong? <laughs> this is yeah. very, very true. Wait a minute, that's physics music. <laughs> you are right, that is physics I see there making his way down to the ring. Not seen much of physics lately, but my oh my, what a wrestler indeed. Yes, he's, he's, he's a, a towering figure and a, quite a high flyer. Got some suplexes on him as well. He's uh, He's got pretty much all the tools, all the tools to make it the top of the JFW. Maybe this is finally his time to get some championship gold around his waist. Did he come off a win on Friday? I believe he did, yes. yes. Yeah, yeah, so, you know. Yeah. This could be his chance to really get a run. Could be, yeah, and we just hope that gravity doesn't bring him back down. You know, he's, he's got the uh, stars in his eyes, ready to go. But we'll see, we'll see. I think the only thing that, I mean, gravity's not gonna bring this guy down. The only thing that could possibly bring him down is creative having nothing for him. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. It would be a back office problem, wouldn't it? And uh, I think it's an easy sell. You look at him there, magnificent specimen of a man. Yep, coming off a big win against Dimmy fucking G. <laughs> oh, I didn't realise it was against that jobber, so maybe not quite the big win, but still a good start. <laughs> and here's Dale. That's very distracting, isn't it? The no dice on his, Fuck <laughs> off, on his penis. It, it certainly draws the attention. <laughs> it does almost. But then you just look a little bit north, and you met with that beautiful webbed up championship. Oh yes, the most beautiful belt in all of professional wrestling. It's coveted. <laughs> it is indeed. Jim, uh, Jimmy Fantastic famously losing that at uh, big one. At WrestleMania, yeah. That's the one. You got me there. <laughs> but who did he lose it to? I forget. Fucking Norse out of it. <laughs> no, you couldn't have been Norse because there are no dice. No, there are no dice indeed. And this guy's here to prove it. <laughs> yeah. Yep, so chain of custody of this belt going quite simply. Jimmy lost it in a... Uh, well, he didn't put up much of a fight against Space Cadet. Space Cadet held it for a day. Span into by Dio. Allegedly a snipe. And Dio here. Immediately on the defense against physics. Yeah. Introducing the challenger what a monster. from England, weighing in at 260 pounds, the original gangster, <laughs> the irresistible force, the immovable object, the <laughs> professor. He's got four names. <laughs> Quite the handle. <laughs> Only 29 years old, Dio. Wow. 
Despite despite turning pro 30 years ago, I don't know how he's still 29, but he is. Looks like a man twice his age. <laughs> yep. Yeah, certainly a grizzled vet of a few matches here in the JFW. It's, it's that Welsh countryside that does that to a man. <laughs> yeah. It's more defeats inside the Welsh countryside, isn't it? Well, we can't talk about those on stream, L. This is true. <laughs> <laughs> given up, you've given up forty pounds to the big man. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta think that that's going to be a disadvantage. Absolutely, yeah. Height advantage, the weight advantage, the athleticism advantage. Look at that. <sighs> I also heard him referred to as a professor. Not something I think uh, Dionysian can claim. No, that's true. But Dio's got that Welsh grit and determination that's famous throughout all of Wales. And the sniper's accuracy. <laughs> yes. If you really targets those joints. Yes, a master of joint manipulation. And the mental game, of course, Dionysian. Oh, one of his strongest points. One of his strongest points. So here we are, mental game. Now now on the ground. It's good to be putting that mental game to work here. An inverse face lock. <laughs> hammer claw. <laughs> Interesting moves. I might incorporate them to, into my own repertoire. Oh, more going for a more technical approach, perhaps down the future. Oh, look at that cross! Oh my God, devastating punches, unloading into physics face. Physics having none of it though. Is back up, ready to go. Yeah, beautiful uppercuts. <laughs> oh, look at this! The arrogance. Oh. This this is the confidence of this man. This what this is what a win in the GFW gives you, a little bit of swag. Oh, it certainly does indeed. And sometimes a loss will take all your swag away from you. Won't be seen for many shows. <laughs> yep. Just a nod towards the previous Remdo title holder. <laughs> no shade. <laughs> Hashtag no hate. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Makit. Oh god, yeah, that's what I was hoping nobody would say, mention that move, to be honest. Oh, that, oh, that would get, oh. if I said that, my sword would be removed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was. Oh dear. Congratulations, you've earned one yank. They are starting to come into the match now. Yes. Yeah, a little bit change. late, but here he is getting some momentum going his way. <laughs> oh, dear. oh, what the knee on the, on oh, the neck Oh, wow. Big power bomb again from Dio. This is a pretty impressive performance from Dio. I mean, he is. It a is. I mean, considering he mustn't have any skills because he couldn't have rolled any dice to level up. <laughs> yeah, advancement obviously quite tricky when there are no dice. It's just all. He's getting it done here, isn't he? Wow. Well. Or oh, he was. Yes. It's an interesting get up there, you know. I mean, I, you don't want to paint all Welsh people with the same sort of image, farmers. But certainly an American sort of prepper influence on Dio's gear there. Well, it's a sniper outfit. Yeah, I, I don't know. A ghillie suit. This strikes me more as a farmer that's going out at four o'clock and for some reason doesn't want to get spotted. <laughs> <laughs> Except by the sheep, hence he's given them a target. <laughs> oh, well. oh, that's a... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, but also probably shouldn't obviously, say. <laughs> obviously, the Welsh are the only people oh, allowed to do, do this. Obviously, if you were, you and I were to do it, it would be appropriation. <laughs> it would and, be cultural and, appropriation. And, and that is very wrong. <laughs> what a move there from physics. Unbelievable, the dive over the top rope. Yeah, oh, calculating there, the uh, angle of momentum. 
Oh god, he spun him around with that kick. Yeah, defying gravity itself. Tayo just desperate to get back into the ring. Obviously, physics predates gravity. <laughs> he does, yeah, yeah. He invented it, didn't he? He did, yes. <laughs> didn't exist before him. That is really not the set of a uh, set of pants. That design. It's not what I would. <laughs> it's pretty sick. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. Not becoming of a, uh, of a professor, though, perhaps. perhaps. But here we are, we are seeing the wild side, aren't we? <laughs> exactly. I mean, how many professors behind closed doors would wear these kind of leathers? <laughs> I would have to quite a few. Yeah, I, I would rate so too. Yeah, and you can also buy your own set from the JFW gift shop. <laughs> yeah. Jim, that's not true. I learned from the ancient texts. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I too visited the British Museum and saw the Rosetta Stone. <laughs> it's actually, uh, it's actually on the Bayou Tapestry, isn't it? A bit of our CD. Is it really? Yeah. Oh, I just want to give that a quick. Well, you know, as a former education professional, every day is a school day. <laughs> I just made that up. <laughs> you would lie to me live on stream, huh? <laughs> Sorry. This is not on. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Invented by and refined by. <laughs> Put it down to a science. Oh. Dear. Ooh. <laughs> here we go. Huge move here. Oh. Oh. Have broken his back. Physics just proven too much for Dio. Yeah, yeah, he's going up. This could be the green apple. No, this is just no, elbow, no one home. <laughs> just another shitty conquer. <laughs> oh, dirty what? deeds done with sheep. D dirty sniping deeds. Oh. Not getting it done now. Oh, I thought he had him there. What amazing, amazing resilience from physics to kick out of that devastating manoeuvre. <laughs> Dio. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. And a bulldog for good measure. That was a frenzied attack. <laughs> it sure was. Wow. Physics having none of it. Oh! <laughs> Drop kick to the knee. And of course he needs those. Those knees get put to good use in the mornings. <laughs> well, the height get differential. It's ready. <laughs> Who's oh. he going to land at this time? Can he land a green apple from that distance? Oh, he does! What a glorious manoeuvre. This must be it. He's That's got it. it! He's done it! The sniper wide of the target. <laughs> what a manoeuvre. Now a maybe fantastic this is... match. Yeah, maybe this is now physics time to shine. Your new Wemmedor champion. Well, well. What have we got up next then? I can't remember. Me neither. <laughs> Let's look at these highlights. <laughs> Some massive prowess here. Oh, Athleticism. We... Oh, chopped to the knees there. Well, next up, we've got uh, <laughs> inspired by uh, this is this this match has been a couple of weeks in the brewing actually. There's been there's been a lot of bad blood between these these two fellas. Elliot has apologised for it about 47 times, but they're going to have a match anyway. Next up, it's Elliot versus Artemis. What's the beef here? Oh, <coughs> have you seen the clip? No. 
Oh, I sh totally should have lined up the clip to play. That would have been brilliant, wouldn't it? They, see if I that had would have been good heat, good heat for the match. If I had a brain, that's what I would have done. Build up Instead. a bit of anticipation and excitement amongst the crowd. TLDR. I'm, I'm going to play it here. Just, just the muse, just the sound. Here we go. Oh. Yeah, I did that was <laughs> No offense, but fuck me. You're horrible. <laughs> I mean, all right, so am I. To be fair, but also completely like massively exaggerated. Oh, it's really coming through well. on the stream, like, I think. <laughs> fuck off. Like, how can you? How can you be that negative? How can you be that negative about people? You know, people playing in Chalice, given, given your own horrendous record. I mean, <laughs> is there not some element of like, you know? Do you not like feel when you do you not like when you when you're insulting all these people? Don't you don't you think? But aren't I a sh massive shitter? You know, aren't 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 I constantly flinging feces? Well, when I when I even dared to enter Chalice anyway, aren't aren't, aren't I f flinging flinging feces at each other? Sorry. <laughs> even even tax is sorry on the end. <laughs> But there you go, devastating words from Elliot there. Did you manage to catch that, Wanger? I did not. Yep, uh, <laughs> as I said, Jimmy, you were playing it just to the stream. Yeah, sorry, that's all I could do. I'll watch the VOD, I'm sure I'll be both <laughs> shocked and uh, bemused by it all. <laughs> yeah. Well, essentially, essentially, uh, this is Elliot's entrance. <laughs> this is Elliot's entrance. The rowdy one. <laughs> He's rowdy. The rowdiest of rowdies. Appropriating Irish culture like only an Englishman could. <laughs> you don't have a beard like that and not be Irish. <laughs> exactly. This is true. And uh, half American. <laughs> or was it the other way around? But yeah, so essentially, um, um, Elliot called out Art for the way in which he talks about people when they're playing Chalice and pointed out Art's horrendous Chalice record and made oh. a little jab about when Art dares play Chalice. Yeah, Art, Art actually yep. turned down his ticket this season. Oh. For, for what reason? Maybe because he thought he'd lose in the first round. I don't know. Maybe his team wasn't very good. I nearly oh. turned it down once when my team was shit. But like I won two or three games, so it was all right. Well, that's Imagine. the thing. It's like like scoring. You know what I mean? It's just one of those instrumental things that you have to do. <laughs> yeah. Who <laughs> stole this pot of feces? <laughs> yeah, he's just got to play Blood Bowl. Like, I, I don't know why he turned it down. Maybe he just didn't want to play scheduled games of Blood Bowl. Like, it's pretty horrible, isn't it, playing scheduled it's, games of Blood Bowl? It's, it's soul destroying. <laughs> yeah. It is not great. <laughs> like, to play a game is bad enough, <laughs> but to play a scheduled game is crippling. <laughs> yeah. I certainly agree. So, a bit of a grudge match here. Hopefully, uh, both competitors come out with a bit of enthusiasm. And here we go. Art straight off, picking Elliot up, poising him over his back. Oh, and he drops him down on the canvas. Oh, boy. Elliot looks hurt already. Big clothesline, though. Massive clothesline. Now, I thought this guy's head was bigger than this. <laughs> yeah, I made it a bit small. I thought it was too fucking big. It looked too small. <laughs> <laughs> And he's still got a big fucking head, to be fair. He's got a big head in real life. But it, you know, it's this kind of big, not cartoon size. <laughs> hey, okay. <laughs> oh, ooh, Elliot here. Some tricks up his sleeve. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Night Demon. Yes, thank you, Night Demon. Farewell. Thank you, Night Demon. I, this is the only reason I came back to the booth, but I'm now fucking leaving. I need the validation. <laughs> oh dear. That's what I live for. Ooh, big back body oh, drop. Oh, massive. Why is Elliot here? He lives to get rowdy. Yeah. The rowdiest wrestler of all time. 
quite That's possibly, awesome. quite possibly here, a very strong argument for Elliot, like, you know, giving the beard a bit of a trim so it doesn't look, look so shaggy. Come on, man, it's it's COVID-19 era. If you don't have oh, a no, beard... I was thinking in this matchup, you don't want to inspire any sort of primal urges in your opponent. <laughs> Is that what gets you going, help? No, I'm, I'm, I'm making a joke about art being Welsh. Oh, okay. I see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do wonder is you should ask him, Chimp. <laughs> oh god, Chimp. <laughs> Commentary's uh, chat's really something tonight. Yeah. They're right. The chat is pretty rowdy tonight, isn't it? Remember, if you want to get involved in this conversation, you've got to do it live. Oh brilliant. Yes, live at twitch.tv slash Jimmy Fantastic. Glorious plugin. Yep, it's one thing to watch it back. But getting involved at the time is fantastic. I'd like no a nice dynamic show here. Also, oh, no. if you'd like, if you'd like some of the finest chocolate Poland can offer, <laughs> go to JimmyFantastic.com. Jimmy-Fantastic.com. Oh yes. <laughs> hyphen is cement. Or you just get taken as some. Um, Don't take our word for it. There's many Glorious. testimonials on the site. Oh, I won't give in. <laughs> Until I'm victorious. There we go. We've got Night Demon and checking in on the side of the RC. <laughs> I mean, who doesn't? Oh, oh dear. And, uh, thank you very much, Ansys, for staying fantastic. 30 months. Absolutely glorious. Three How many? Friends. Yes. <laughs> and a little quarter of one. Oh dear. <laughs> Back of a plane's walker deck, I can read to the audience. <laughs> yep, that's Crash and Bashan. He's one of my customers. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> oh, oh god. We can eat the chocolate live on stream in the hot tub. It can get a bit spicy up in there. <laughs> oh, there's the Kekwini from Artemis. He's got him! Ooh, put practically, him away. practically squashed him. Yeah. He got a little distracted from the match there, but... Oh, he's away! He's away, the rowdy one! Oh, oh, oh. oh look at this! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, rowdy! Lays out the ref. Elliot is fucking oh, raging! Oh. <laughs> and you can understand why after all the beef. Oh, yeah, incredible. Oh, they've made their enemies there. Oh, that was, boy. Yeah, that was intense there. Obviously, uh, JFW does not condone assaulting officials. No. Oh, oh that'll be down to Theresa Mame to handle that, won't it? <laughs> I guess it will, yeah. And now we've got a triple threat. This is oh, two, two, well, we've got a two huge guys and an incredibly dangerous guy. We've got Goliath, Frosty, and Night Demon. Triple threat. Whoever gets the first pin wins the match. Big mix bag this one. It is, isn't it? Yeah, this is uh, very up in the air. We've got you know, things happening. Yep, Wrestling things match. happening from three ways. Lots of threats coming Huge in. Huge stats, power moves guaranteed. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, no, the thing is. I'm not sure who's going to win this match, but you know, I know who's got the marble pedigree. <laughs> and who has the marble pedigree? I believe Frosty's the, the informed marble guy mm -hmm. out of the three. <laughs> oh, it's a bit brave to be using a black light for this, isn't it? <laughs> Very brave, yeah. <laughs> Baby. He's got nothing to hide. Literally, he's got everything on display. He has indeed. Not much <laughs> imagination required. Like paint by numbers. <laughs> Sorry, Lottie, it was a joke. Okay, yeah, that's good. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't watch the VOD. Sorry about that. <laughs> yep. So just a little, little joke, should I just do paint my numbers? 
Yeah. <laughs> Tells me. Obviously, this track and this entrance is on most people's bedroom CDs. Everybody has one. <laughs> oh, this is the poster you have. This on is my way. track seven. This is when things really go down. <laughs> If we if we'll ever see a Goliath hot tub stream, imagine that. Imagine. <laughs> Do you know what? Someone posted a clip of somebody. Uh, It'd have to be separate. <laughs> well, it, it, this is reminding me of a Goliath hot tub stream, right? Someone posted a someone posted a uh, a clip, a, a blood bowl clip, right? A flicky flap. And in the related clips, um, there was a hot tub stream, and it was just. It was just a woman sat in a bucket. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. And she, she was like, can't afford a hot tub. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's can't, genius. Can't afford a hot tub. How, <laughs> how big was the bucket? It was, it was like, it was yeah. big enough for her to sit in. And that's what, that's what a Goliath hot tub stream would look like, isn't it? Quite, that's quite true. possibly, quite possibly. I mean, we've only got the six quid so far, so we are doing our bucket hot tub stream at the moment. <laughs> yeah. I, I probably wouldn't even get my foot in it. <laughs> No messing around here, Frosty straight into the ring. Egging on the crowd, you want some? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he looks like a large bottle of Frosty Jacks. Yeah, he is a, he is a, an ex-seaman. Yes, Night Demon. Not accompanied by his six feet down under his teammates. Yeah. Oh, was there a full down out of those guys? No, it's just it's a triple threat, so there's no there's no oh. ringside interference in these matches. Well, that's good. Surely with them ringside it would be definitely a different case altogether. Mm. Dominant faction that they are. Absolutely, but they're defeated by the Snackers from I don't know what to think about that. On paper, it shouldn't have happened, but we're here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm the damn right chimp. <laughs> and that's, uh, that goes two ways. You don't interfere in his ring, he won't interfere in yours. A gym guarantee. <laughs> Again, you just have to remove Jimmy's choice in the map. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't. What's wrong? You shouldn't be doing that. Oh dear. And force feed him like things like Oreos, <laughs> white Twixes. Fall force force feeds him white Twixes. Yeah, he, he does. Nobody, yeah. nobody calls that out as being wrong. <laughs> no, that's true. It's just a light sharing of white Twixes between friends. He's trying to stuff a kebab down in your throat as well, isn't he? Yeah, he is, yeah. He keeps, he keeps threatening the kebab. I've managed to avoid it so far. Oh my god, look at that! See, power moves on display. Unbelievable. What's Frosty doing here? Oh, just a huge punch to the gut. Massive punch to the gut there. Night Demon surely can't take many of those. Look at that. Well, there's we been a lot of night? raging attacks this, this evening. S somewhat a precursor for when people return to uh, all you can eat buffets. <laughs> yes. Which will be true war zones. <laughs> Could you imagine Goliath in that situation? Oh boy. Well, you wouldn't want to go up against him without backup. 
<laughs> Absolutely not. If you ever see a, uh, a bouncer on the door of the Toby Carvery, it is likely <laughs> that Goliath is in town. Or, like, or maybe you're just like in worrying or something. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, do you remember when they used to oh, have... Or Ipswich. Yeah, do you remember when they used to have hey. uh, bouncers on the subway? Yeah, yeah. 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 It, it, it's just a shithole, but people aren't hard, so, you know. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, there was an amazing thing happened, but we shouldn't talk about it in the wrestling. Let's, uh... Let's keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Goliath. <laughs> Goliath taken a few moments to recover there while uh, Night Demon gets his neck tweaked. Yeah. Like shoulder massage. Looks like Frosty's probably doing more damage to his own wrist there, but. <laughs> it does, you know. It does be like that. By the look of the chat, Flicky's already in a frenzy about thinking about Buffy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We haven't seen the end times before that they reopen. Oh god, could you imagine? Could you imagine Flicky there? Every fucking time! <laughs> you get to the fucking chicken! It's fucking <laughs> done! It's spreadsheet empty. told me! <laughs> I have to just have the badges, it's bullshit! <laughs> Oh wow, look at that shoulder charge from from Frosty. I'm trying to weaken the zombane. Which does use your shoulder, doesn't it? Yeah. No? Yeah. Oh okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good commentary then. Yeah. Big yeah. headbutt as well. <laughs> oh my. I was just gonna. I was just about to say the ref is looking sharp this evening. Uh, Mike Demon in a rage of jealousy. Thought this is a handsome guy. Perhaps ref violence being normalised after Elliot cracked one in the jaw earlier. Yeah, that's true. Could see the start of a worrying trend here. Oh shit! Pedigree. Goliath not can't react. This could be it. Could be a smash and grab. Nope. Yeah, Night Demon kicking out there. No help from Goliath at all. I'm not seeing much of Goliath in this. Just laying on the floor mostly. Oh! Diving shoulder tackle. Goliath's out of there. Just going in to finish what he started. Just a one. Close. Yep. Pick a wrestler. Jimmy Fantastic, of course. <laughs> the famous chocolatier. <laughs> Available in eight different flavors. Some say, some, some say he's a lot like Jim, uh, Willy Wonka. <laughs> yeah, or at least that's what I think people were calling him. <laughs> no, Tony plays Paul. He's the best. Yeah, of course. He's better, he's better than Jim. He, to be fair, Tony's even better than Demon Rick, isn't he? And EAB, like EAB's pretty damn good, though. EAB's great, yeah. EAB or Tony, one of the two. But hey, welcome. WWE Jaden five two three to the to the stream. We hope you enjoy. <laughs> yeah. See Jimmy, you do attract actual viewers. Yeah, an actual viewer. Hello. Uh, the Rock is my favourite wrestler. I guess. Oh, do angle though. It's hard, isn't it? Actually, rude. Not Bobby. <laughs> Rick. There you go. Jimmy likes his men bald. Why do you say that, Jim? Well, he likes he likes to have his men have a certain amount of hair. Yeah. And but... there's one thing he doesn't go near, so it doesn't need to be dealt with. <laughs> the Rock had hair for like all of his real run, didn't he? It was only when he came back as Hollywood, Hollywood uh, Rock that he he had uh, he had gone bald and. I preferred Kurt before he got his head shaved as well, to be honest. Oh, 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 Kurt with his wig was amazing. <laughs> oh, Kurt with his wig. Holy moly. Oh. Big slam there from Goliath. God, Goliath's big, isn't he? He, <laughs> he is big. He would look fucking tiny. Has <laughs> he got him? No. no. Not on this occasion. Goliath waking up, though. He's 
finding some resolve from somewhere inside and getting himself back into this match. Oof. Trapezius Claw. <laughs> We've seen the 10 matches. We have, yeah. Oh, he lays him clean out. Fucking <laughs> floors him. This is a scene like outside of Best Kebabs on the 2 a 2am on a Saturday night. <laughs> it sure is. Except without the earthquake splash normally. <laughs> yeah. oh. I've seen it happen. I've seen it happen. <laughs> that is back hair, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Is this it? He's got him! Go Goliath! Oh wow, you unexpected. There you go. There you go, Fantastic. Goliath. Fantastic. Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah, you're not really a loser if it didn't happen to you, Night Damon. <laughs> Fantastic match there. Goliath coming back, had a really rough start to that and just turned it around, pulled out some resolve and... Yeah, nice Whoa. big... Did he get it done? Big, resu big result after his devastating loss at WrestleMania to yours truly. Yeah, oh, yeah, that... huge loss, huge, huge loss. He wiped the floor with him. Glorious. <laughs> that was Glorious. a hell of a match, wasn't it? That was an it was like Some people glorious. say that that's, that's match of, uh, presented for match of the year. They're saying it's just JFW's first six-star match. <laughs> yeah. I mean, some of those people are me, but that's all I care about. <laughs> well, people are saying that, and you know, that's that's reasonable. <laughs> yeah, and thank you very much, Goliath, for giving the gift sub to Nasuti. <laughs> Glorious, glorious. And see, hoping the ring's being wiped down because otherwise it's another concussion for sure. <laughs> and I will defend. <laughs> I will defend. Oh boy, J5 staying fantastic for 27 months. That's three human pregnancies or nearly seven beaver pregnancies. Glorious. <laughs> Next up, we've got uh, we've got North and South, the new kids on the block, as it were, um, up against the old guard of Dress for Business. Uh, this should be an interesting one, shouldn't it? It certainly should. Dress for Business, a staple of the tech team division. Whereas these two, Antsy and Descotti, you know, unknown quantity is a tag team. Yeah. Why staple in the side of the tag division? Or will they prove to be good? Yeah. That's sort of fawn in the side. Certainly two of the best entrances in the GFW. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah. Hold on to your butts. These are these are glorious entrances. There's the card, J five. Were they guilty J five? He, de he decreed them guilty um, in about three seconds. Wouldn't have got arrested if they weren't guilty. Well, I suppose the more important question, J5, is is it an interesting case? <laughs> Fucking love this. Not for itself. <laughs> Quite metal theme as well, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> these two, these two, obviously not taking themselves too seriously. <laughs> you've got Mike Ashley in a <laughs> in a tracksuit, and then you've got Danny Dyer in a tennis outfit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dressed for business, and of course, this was the outfit worn by Danny Dyer in the business. Yes. It's like dress for business and dress for leisure. <laughs> You know, they're, they're, looking, they're here, they're looking for three more for the five side team tonight. Can anybody help them? <laughs> which North is the one That's with so Toon good. Army and uh, Newcastle Badge and Greg's on his attire. Mostly South Greg's. is the one who looks more like a West Ham supporter. <laughs> Dressed for us, <RCB>. even. <laughs> well, the under the undertone of the evening has been set. <laughs> Oh, this is an amazing entrance as well. Love this one. Oh, Mostly the theme. Yeah, these are dressed for business. They are, but to be fair, the true business is when Lemon takes his top off. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Because that, 
as I've said many times, is peak male performance. Absolutely. Obviously, fox hunting banned, but still putting the outfit to good use. <laughs> yeah. It is still banned, isn't it? Nah, only if you're poor. You say only if you're poor? <laughs> yeah. My man. Rich people get to do what the fuck they want, don't they? By far and large, yep. <laughs> but we'll see what they do here, and they're <laughs> off! Bang. Oh, oh. Cry off the bat. Yeah. Best stabs, best back. <laughs> best face, let's be honest. <laughs> Tash. Best Tash three years running. Start as a Movember joke, but it's stuck around. And it does look good on him. <laughs> yep. Jim most certainly would, would be a fox hunter. <laughs> yep. He's a despicable human being. He sure is. Of course, Table Leg Wang are benefiting from that despicableness. Uh, in in this, uh, you know, to win the world title, I remember. Well, the extra arms belt. Long ago. Yeah, I don't have much of a memory for these things. Yep, me neither. Uh, if he hasn't given me the title, the title shot this week, then you know he could go to hell. <laughs> Fair enough. You know what, what I mean. What are you looking I for, should, Wanger? Uh, all of them. They all should. They, they all would look great on a, my amazing torso. And I'll, t I'll tell you another thing. It would. It would get me in the ring and not talking to you, jabronis. <laughs> this is this is fair. Well, obviously we're going to see a quick uh, return to my uh, even against Doctor's orders. A quick return to my career, <laughs> judged by some feedback we've received lately. Is that, is that what people are calling it these days? A career? <laughs> well, you know, flash in the pan, <laughs> the viral video equivalent certainly, of a career. Certainly, quite an impressive wrestling career for a seagull. Yeah. Yes. The Scotty. Deceptively nimble. He is, isn't he? Yeah. Very large man. Oh! oh I thought he was going to throw him out of the ring there. I thought we had a casualty. Yeah, I did as well. That would have been incredible. Well, being a That's brute cool. from the north, not quite brute tall enough to do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a game. Oh, Look at how long this guy. Whew. Bad times for Fan Fox here. <laughs> oh dear. What did what did they call him? The the the, the fucking ref called him something different, didn't they? Like he called him like Ben Aspen or something. <laughs> I wish I'd bet on that. That was just free money, wasn't it? Not too you know, I'm he's just still he's still a professional fighter. I've just had an incredible idea. What about Hot Tub Hammageddon? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Say no more. Yeah. Surely that would be the best commentary boost for that kind of event. That would be cool. I only have nine bits left, but I'm throwing them in. Can <laughs> 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 you expect... <laughs> You'll expect that lemon, you know, being the smoothest member of the roster. Yeah. No doubt. I don't know if you know Al, but saying that he was he's a professional fighter, he's he's a professional fighter that can never could strike ever. Oh. <laughs> didn't didn't train. Well, for the yeah, fight but you still all. have some sort of like innate things about distancing and all that sort of shit in you. There's like. Look there's there's something to it, but and obviously also, the guy can't scrap. You know? And also, boxing is more fixed than fucking wrestling. <laughs> True enough. Because yeah. this, we do not know the outcomes. This is all unscripted. Or as um, youngins would say, procedurally generated. Now, Demon there, just throw up his mouth a little bit about that suggestion. Well, vomit can be used as a lubricant. <laughs> some some slightly say, burning one, but... <laughs> some would say the best. No, you the best you play the ball as it lies. You play the ball as it lies. You work with the materials you have. 
<laughs> for a bit of out of ring action here. Yeah, this is. I prefer this to be honest. Out of ring, you know, we don't don't like action in the ring. Well, we've we've discussed this in great depth, and I think you'll find we do. <laughs> yeah. Oh, <dear. laughs> we've oh. truly hit new low today. <laughs> yep. Oh, look at this. He's doing the old crab walk. He's ready. He hit the spine buster. Oh, he's gone for the fox's elbow. Pooch. <laughs> Can Ansi get in to stop it? He's not trying. <laughs> oh. oh. oh Massive Ansi. win for Dreff for business there. You could look as shocked as you like there, Ansi. You've got to get in the help. That yep. was terrible. Yeah, that's After not such great. promise with the combinations that they had together. Yeah. Did not have his back at the end. Yeah, it's always tough to stomach, you know, being part of a tag team where that has happened um, a couple <laughs> of times. It, it's 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 just a teething thing, you know, you get used to each other more as you get into tag matches together. But certainly something for North and South to take back to the locker room and uh, discuss in private. Yep. <laughs> I somehow feel the next Greg's is going to have to be an anti. <laughs> for sure. I'd say right. next two. And <laughs> the next couple of lines as well. Yeah, maybe all those con concussions just catching up on him a bit there. <laughs> Every bloody Greg's is on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. So there you go, dress the business, maybe getting back on top of things. Or just putting away a couple of jobbers that <laughs> probably don't have a chance of making a run in the tank division. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, all speculation. We'll see how how that pans out. Now I've got two chaps in hats. It's so good, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> yes. Rick on an absolute tear. He is, yeah. Been, Can't be stopped. He's been pretty much unstoppable since returning and winning the rumble. Uh, Squirrel dude is former champ, isn't he? So, you know, he's uh, he's been Wemdorp champ. He's been. Chaos chosen champ. Mm. And, uh, he may well find his nuts in this match. He's certainly going to need them. Yeah. Oh shit, Wangy, did you see that dude doing the Batista entrance? Like teacher guy. I sure did, yeah. Almost as good as us, wasn't he? Almost. <laughs> but I have to say that. Perhaps our best performance was our Michael Flatley dance. <laughs> oh, no doubt. <laughs> the river dance. <laughs> yeah. we're, nim we're nimble, virile fellows. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do you have to put that on the YouTube, Jim. We've done it many an evening, and people just let us get on with it. They know not to get involved. <laughs> Oh dear, so many times. We just take up the whole road. <laughs> it's true, it's true. It's magical to see. <laughs> yeah, Night Demon, yeah, Demon Rig was, was rather pathetic, wasn't he? <laughs> Chaps and hats. No, I was trying to not say dance hats here. <laughs> the fear of my life. <laughs> Yeah, we've, we've, we've definitely done more more flat leads than uh, Batista's, but still. We have, yeah. Particularly the machine gun part of the Batista entrance. True, true. However, I, I feel that that's, that's the only thing that did let that guy down is the machine gun. He didn't really exactly. go into the machine gun. But all the rest of the mannerisms were, were spot on. Yeah, yeah, it was great. But that is what let him down, ultimately. He didn't have that machine gun on point. But as you can I see from that entrance, Squirrel Dude had it down to a fine art. <laughs> Obviously not really able to do the machine gun in the setting that he was in. He could have done it better than he did. <laughs> <laughs> not a good image. Not a good image. School teacher. <laughs> yeah, okay. He still should have done it. 
the shots. <laughs> I've got no idea, Cocky, but hello. I don't think I said hello. Look at that, the extra arms belt champion. Rick loving it. Oh, yes. A man with some of the most electrifying promos in JFW history. Absolutely. Mr. Knight, Blood Bowl Jesus. <laughs> yep. Yeah, he's just taken everybody by storm, hasn't he? Continues to do well. Is it true that he has a dark side to him? <laughs> There's certainly rumours, yes, that he is in fact a serial killer and keeps the heads of his victims in his freezer. <laughs> I, I heard it, I heard him say mean, mean things once on a on a stream. He's definitely said a bunch of mean things on streams, yeah. He has indeed. People love to clip them whenever he says anything vaguely mean. <laughs> <laughs> Cool <laughs> here, get into work. We could do it the opposite for you, couldn't we? We could sit whenever you, whenever uh, someone you say anything vaguely nice. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's having a Hancock. He said he would burn somebody's like. That's a nice record, isn't it? Very nice record. And his body just couldn't handle that he'd been nice, so he farted and burped at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow, look at that elbow to the dome of Squirrel Dude. Yep, trying to crack his nut. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. Interesting that he's dressed up like a throw washer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, try to, try to control yourself, Wanger. <laughs> when Papa Piccolo <laughs> turns up on my screen, some people might be disappointed, but I just pole vault over the announce desk. <laughs> because if there's something I love, it's a Ferrero Rocher. Perfectly understandable. I love, I love three things in this in this world, and that's Ferrero Rochers, my family, and my car. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> You're missing something off that list, and it's okay, you know. <laughs> We can extend the list of four things. People don't often say there's only four things I love in this world. But oh, yeah. I yeah. don't like seagulls. <laughs> now, 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 Wang, don't play I, oh, actually, I will add a fourth thing just for you. Yep. Marbles. Hey. Oh. Oh, I just... <laughs> God, you know. <laughs> ass. Yeah, I was thinking that eating ass. <laughs> That's what I was oh, trying yes, to set him up for. Oh, she's giving it. I was she, trying to set you up for she's it. You stitched, fool. She stitched me up. <laughs> Good show, honey. Good show. <laughs> Do your best. Oh, so they have Drake tokens in magic now. So, would you like to yeah. rethink your top three? It's amazing. Uh, no, I'll keep, I'll keep, I'll keep, I'll keep them, uh, no, 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 I do love, they fucking love the car. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the calf crush on Rick! Oh, out of nowhere. Oh, Rick's not tapping to that. Oh, boy. <laughs> Making a cummy, what the hell? Fucking hell, fucking Mark. <laughs> That's a bit out there. <laughs> oh, oh my god. J5 asking the questions. And if not, that is your birthday present table, Like You are welcome. <laughs> J5 the, with the ideas. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is too graphic. Um, okay, if you like the third one of your list, you should listen to the song Welcome to the Cum Zone. <laughs> Oh, we also need to know J5's stance on this. <laughs> Chimp, ask him. Oh, God. <laughs> the answer is number four, making lists. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh, dear me. Oh, Rick here with a <laughs> side breaker. <laughs> yes. Sorry, Bezel, I've really stitched myself up again. <laughs> Jesus, I should just stop talking. 
when I, when I when I should be quiet and let El talk, you know, there's a serious problem. <laughs> yep, and there's the flip me, guys. This could be it for Squirrel Dude. No, he kicks out. Unbelievable. A spectacular fashion there, the move. Just getting pulled off with perfect precision and Squirrel Dude not. It's still got some in the tank. Yeah. Rick roll, sorry. Rick. That's the Rick roll. It's, the Rick it's roll, so, yeah, easy yeah. To, so easy to get them confused. What did I call it? I Net called crank. it the flip me, but it was the Rick roll. Oh, okay, okay, I just the, probably just referred to it He has it a flipping a power driver, you see. He has a flipping power driver, so that's obviously the flip me. And then he has the 720 splash or whatever, which is the Rick roll. J5, um, no, I don't get really any more consumption of Ferrero Rocher on my birthday. Um, it's just a year-round Rocher fest. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think you I think the originals are always best. Um, the other varieties, while nicer, not nothing oh. on the old. What a maneuver! What a maneuver! Oh. That go and move for move on these fancy acrobatic displays from the top rope. Yeah. Yeah, a, a nice healthy amount of adversity coming Rick's way. Oof. Well, Chimp, you're wrong on many counts. I don't know. Be interesting to find out. <laughs> it's only a little bit spiky. I'm sure it'd be fine. Yeah, it's more bumpy than spiky, really. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, you imagine that hot tub, but for a rush it. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, the calf crusher again. This could be it. This is the second time it's been applied. Rick's going to struggle here. He's, he's gone. Tapped. Oh, he's... Yeah. What an upset. Whew. That is a massive upset. Squirrel dude coming out of obscurity and... Yeah, put on the He's been champ. He is a champ. Oh, boy. And convincingly, too. Yeah. Of course, non-title match, but uh, incredible performance. And sent a big message sent by Squirrel Dude there, isn't it? Squire L Dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Rip not been able to overcome that adversity there. It's uh I he's been he's been he's been hard at work the past few shows, hasn't he, to be fair? Yeah, this could be fatigue. Yeah, not to it's take not anything full. away from Squirrel. He's got a full schedule with all the promos, the daytime TV appearances, trips, secret undercover trips to Bean Manor, I've heard. <laughs> yeah. That, leave, that would leave any man tired. <laughs> the dungeon of debauchery at Bean Tower is often spoken about. The success, the success, su su success it changes you. <laughs> it does. What's our next match? Do we have another match? We do. It's the main event next. Oh, okay. Okay. And it is cock and ball torture. Oh, well. My former teammates. Yeah. Yeah, the old uh, cock ball and wang torture if, if teamed up with wang at some time. Nice. We were, we were dominant. We were dominant. Absolutely dominant, yeah. Testicles all over getting shattered. <laughs> yeah. No balls were safe. It's, I can imagine. It's true. And uh, the fucking I, rats, of course, were, were kind of out of the picture at that time. But now they're back. And uh, this is, a, you know, big, could be a big, big win for them tonight. It, you know, non title match. CVT are the tag team champs. And uh, yeah, you know, a huge return of the fucking rats. Yeah, a massive return. It could have them to get a shot at the champs, but obviously not the belt, as you mentioned, non-tag team match, non-title match even. Um, yeah, um, it's it's good. They can get some practice in here, show what they've got. And when there's a rat in the game, anything can happen. You can't write them off. No, exactly. You really can't. You need half a rat on the pitch and get things done. And there's always that chance of bullshit. <laughs> um... Well, WWE, Jaden, it would probably be, um, <laughs> thinking about it. Oh. Um, it would be Ric Flair for me. It would be Liv Morgan, personally. 
Oh, strong choice for different reasons. <laughs> yeah. I just Whoa. don't know. How, I don't know how you can make that choice when Mandy Rose is on the roster. Yeah, it's, it's hard, man. It's a three-way. It's a three-way race, isn't it, between those two and Alexa Bliss? See, I'm just very confused right now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just. 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 I'm gonna need a minute. <laughs> Why are you trying to piece something together? <laughs> oh, Tom Schnees. Oh, dear, the fucking rats. <laughs> Climbing the hamster reel there. <laughs> who, would, who would you pick WWE Jaden 523? You'd pick, You'd pick Night, Night Demon. Demon. <laughs> oh, or is he asking? Night Demon's a good choice. Pick a wrestler, Night Demon. <laughs> Charlotte Flair, controversial. Very controversial. <laughs> well, Sheila's got some muscles on her, isn't she? CBT, yep. Yeah, yeah, and she's got a pretty, uh, she's got a face that reminds you of Ric Flair, which is not really what you wanted to be reminded of from a lady, is it? <laughs> oh, yes, yeah, Oh, dear, yes, Mrs. Wango has got a thing for Cesaro. Yeah, who doesn't? Four. Yeah, it's true. He seems like a very nice guy. Yeah, he needs to get back the old gimmick with the with the uh, shades and that. And that was brilliant. Oh, the, what the James Bond thing? Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Well, to be fair, to be fair, I think so, he's going to get some traction. Let's hope so. Yeah. Oh, big suplex from Chunter. Wise words from Mrs. Wanger there. Do not Google Cesaro nude, <laughs> like she did. Okay. You will. You will get obviously quite, quite, quite the Eiffel. That's obviously what I'm doing instantly. <laughs> I will send you an image. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's uh, that was pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Right. Anyway, let's get back to this, please. <laughs> I'm definitely choosing Cesaro now. Amazing. Oh right, I'm just gonna ban you now. Basham will definitely not be disappointed. Oh, it better not be your phone wallpaper, Mrs. Wanger. <laughs> Let's get back to the match anyway. There is a match happening. Yeah. Oh, oh dear. Chunter here. Perhaps looking for the tag? You'll know no? when you see yes, it. Yes, no. There's the tag. You will know. The 2K15 one. The one with the cannon? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the one. That's the one. Oh, great. So anyway, what a drop pick there. Yeah. Agility from the rats, as you would expect. Yep. But the goblin, the stunty goblin, the literal fucking goblin. <laughs> yeah. Using those big feet to good use. Or educated feet if you're uh, Jerry Lawler. Oh. CBT former champs, yes? Oh, I know. As I thought, I had safe search on. CBT Turns out it wasn't scrolling far enough. Fantastic. 
The fuck and lots of former champs, uh, two time champs, I think. The CBT oh, really? are the current champs. Current champs, excellent. Yeah, they won the the uh, the tables, ladders, chairs match at WrestleMania. So they're two time champs now. Yeah. Well, you know the the tag division goes deep. There's quite a lot of champions in the in the roster. Absolutely, yeah. It is a great yeah, the division. belt never really never really staying stuck. I mean, it's a very competitive division. I can say it's. Uh... Yeah. Beautiful. It seems like it seems like there's a lot of hot two and two action going on. Oh yeah. Only the hottest. <laughs> mm. <laughs> and then, yeah, good. Mm, dear. Mm. Mm. You wouldn't get into a start fight with Cesaro, would you? <laughs> no. Yeah, I'll probably give that one a miss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Finny tossing off Moradan there. And now coming after him. Pounds him into the wall. And again. Not hold no. Maybe they're going for the count out. Oh, it'd be an underwhelming way to finish the match. No, nope, there we are. Looking. There we are. The little goblin back in the ring. <laughs> <laughs> Bad, I would pick Robo Bezel. Yeah, Robo Bezel's a fine choice. Yeah, I like Robo Bezel. <laughs> he does edge out EAB slightly. Just because he's a bit less naked than Bezel. <laughs> yeah. Well, look at this, the two rat, the double rat feet to the side of the head. Brutal. Oh, that wasn't made clear, fucking Amic. <laughs> no, that was not made clear. Oh, dear me. Oh, this is probably why I haven't increased the viewing numbers so much, banning all of the TK yeah, yeah, Fox the new, new players, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Big elbow drop from the top rope. Nice DDT there. Bezel classic. Bezel classic is a classic. It's the it's the socks and the pixelated butthole that do it for me. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Night Demon, yeah. That, that's why I'm followers only, because the 2K people just coming in being fucking idiots. Like, that was tame, that guy, compared to normally what they do. Yeah, you have to consider that some of, these, some of these are children. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, that guy, I looked at his picture, he did seem a bit young for the stream. No. <laughs> oh, dear. this. Boosh! Oh. Kicks him right in the fucking head. Chunter breaks it up. Moradan yep, Chunter, uh, perhaps a, a, a thinly veiled meshes there to north and south. That's how you break a pin up. <laughs> oh. oh. Bit of ring rust from the rats, but they're doing great. Nothing that can't be cleaned off. <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Neck crank. <laughs> Sheila doesn't like it. Sure Not too amused. CBT yet to land any signature moves here. <laughs> yeah, Lemon, when you say it like that, it doesn't sound good, does it? <laughs> and then, talk about high horses and uh, other content that should also be It is probably be best they are banned. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so you can still watch and listen, but you can't take part. Done our bit. <laughs> Still, it was around about 13 where I followed that dark path. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, look at that. The path of arse. <laughs> oh dear me. Oh. 
No oh, shit, look, look at this at one. This is this is claws crazy. on that guy. Oh, oh massive move. Those feet and claws really, really are disturbing. <laughs> they are, aren't they? <laughs> well, he's redeemed his channel points. Change your tap chat chat topic. <laughs> Everyone pick a wrestler. <laughs> <laughs> Cesaro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, <dear>. oh, man. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that from Chunterino. Lovely move. That was quite an alarming. As he sort of bent over there, you saw his the front of his outfit. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you watch, you catch glimpses and it's like that. Ah? Hell, <laughs> 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 kick. Oof. Right in the chops. Oh, going for the stomp, but Morada manages to avoid it. The sneaky goblin. The bulldog. Yeah, expertly performed there by Chanter. The rats are, de are definitely on top of this match, aren't they? Here. Yeah, they are now. Yeah, yeah cock and bull torture not really turning up. All it can take is one blow to the nuts and it's over, though. That's this is true. true. A bit of testicular tension and even the strongest man will crumble. Yeah, but rats, I, I don't know how susceptible they are to the uh, old ball shots. Yeah, it's a hard one. I'm sure some scientists have done some study somewhere, but off the top of my head, I can't think of one. Mm. <laughs> oh, dear. this a pin one two ah oh, it's not enough never give a pin more down off that no it was the, the balls hang out behind their backs oh is that the balls <laughs> alright he's ready to do the cord breaker Draws blood. Cocky Cocky's in here to break this up. In there. Didn't break it up. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, you cannot believe oh, it. Oh my. <laughs> Lays up the rest. He wanted that three count. He felt it deserved it. <laughs> oh my amazing. god. This, this rat clearly has frenzy. Oh, dear. oh, this has been something else tonight here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry. This is. Not good sportsmanship. This has been brutal for the refs. The ref, the ref a true the... professional though, he's up. And so the, greatest, the greatest moment of being up the ref was when the ref got curb stomped. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was a classic, wasn't it? Absolute classic. Um, and yeah, Chimp, I think I'd let Liv Morgan do anything she wanted to me, to be honest. But would you, if she wanted you to? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh man, I don't know you could say that. <laughs> oh <dear. laughs> oh, fuck off, J5. <laughs> Hello, to Fixer. <laughs> Hello, to Fixer. Welcome to the stream. We're in the middle of a match here <laughs> between cock and ball torture and a couple of rats. <laughs> the fucking rats, and all this. But are they going to be able to fuck if they've got no balls left? That's the question. And again, yet to see any bullshit. That's an interesting question, Mrs. Wanger. Answer the question, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I would. I'd pick Cesaro. <laughs> oh. You don't pick Cesaro, Cesaro picks you. Chanter feeling the burn here. He has been putting in most of the legwork during this match. He has, yeah, yeah. Finney has, has been on the on the side a lot. 
<laughs> True words have never been spoken. <laughs> oh, that'd be no problem at all. Easier. It's an absolute go to. <laughs> oh, look at this. Trying to submission here. The sneaky rat worms his way out. Look at this, putting the edge for good use there. Still refusing to go oh, for the pin here, and he's already exhausted. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Shouldn't have played possum. And now he's going to tag in Finney. Finney must be fresh, fresh as a daisy. He's barely taken oh. part in this match. Oh, God. Oh, Wild no. misses here. <laughs> oh, what? The cheeky claw to the face. The already bloodied face. What is Sheila really doing? Is she walking around... <laughs> He likes to walk around in circles, Sheila. Um, I thought she was walking around um, Cocky's body. <laughs> no, she just occasionally walks around in circles. Nice. <laughs> trying to get the, trying to find the kitchen. Oh, man, dude. Well, you can't be saying that, J5. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Look, we oh, have to do a more pro progressive environment. Oh, coup de gras. Yeah, brutal. Those gigantic rat feet. This might be enough to put a raid. Little fucking goblin is already busted open. Oh, There's your two count. He's too resilient, Maradam. You cannot put this guy down. I mean, goblins are tough, aren't they? When you think the life they have, being bullied by orcs all the time, they're just they're just tough as fuck, aren't they? By the time they uh, they they reach this kind of level. Yeah. <sighs> No stranger to adversity. Exactly. Come on, Penny, Finny, put some fucking work in, mate. You can't <laughs> tag him in. <laughs> Jesus, Chanter. He's up. He looks like he's up for it. Yeah. Whether he wants to be or not. Oh, and there you go. Another one. Second cold break. This has got to be a chilling. Moradam has been abused. Got a thing that Cocky's going to interfere here. Yeah. Oh, just yeah. in time. Was Chunder oh. going for the whiff? Again. <laughs> Again, yeah. Ref trying to talk him down. Chunder's having none of it. <laughs> what a, oh my god. Moradan is just covered in blood now. Oh. All the way back to the corner as well. Oh god. This is just savage. Look at Finney. Look at the state of Finney. What kind of cardio has he got? He's done nothing this match. You know, that's what lockdown life does to you. <laughs> yeah, it really takes you out of game. Oof. Pretty close. Paradigm finding the something there. Chant still the doesn't want to tag out, though. Bl pouring with blood still doesn't tag. <laughs> He's reveling in it. He's some <laughs> kind of sadist. <laughs> yeah. So jokes on you. This is my ideal Friday night. <laughs> Give me more, please. The sick thing about that is it's a Monday. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, everybody looks forward to the Friday to be able to have that sort of excitement on a Monday. I don't know. Living the life. <laughs> Living the life. Oh, oh. The ref, ref doesn't want to count. Do the count. The ref has decided he's no the ref's longer going to deal with it. Sheila came up and distracted oh, the no. off off screen. But Cocky's just so been this could still be it. Yep, Cocky's been annihilated. Moradam's got wrecked. This could be it. This could very well be it, and we're here one. Oh. It is. <laughs> the fucking rats. A huge win over the champs. I mean, they dominated them, didn't they? Actually, that was. Another shocker. Another shocker. We've had some real upset tonight. Yeah, we have nice indeed. Upsets. Wow. A night of fantastic matches, though. Yep, it is claw tonight, Hampox. Monday night claw. 
Unless you're on YouTube, in which case it can be whatever night you want it to be. <laughs> yes. But this match took place live Monday night, the 19th of April at, oh shit, 8 UTC. Yep. Tonight's ringing like your numbers are. <laughs> Do you remember the old, uh, you've been framed yeah. videos of oh, where oh, they would uh, play last week's numbers and make them think they're a partnered one? <laughs> Classic. <laughs> well, if you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to pick a wrestler. <laughs> Leave your wrestler in the comments along with a like or a dislike if you've not enjoyed the video. Yep, it doesn't really matter whether you like it or dislike it. They're, they all They all improve the algorithm because YouTube just want, uh, you know... Engagement. Even better. Engagement. Yeah, that's the word. That's Think the word. in your mind what wrestler I'm thinking of in the comments. <laughs> Answer on next week's show. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant wang it. So there you go. Um, thank you very much, Wanger. Thank you very much, Elp. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic. <laughs>